will miss Sarova White Sands. That Me was too. so nice, baby. Yeah. So guys, the taxi is here. We have to go. We're going to Nairobi by SGR train, and from Nairobi, we'll be flying home. Stay tuned. Alright guys, we just arrived to SGR Terminus in Mombasa yeah. and we are just uh, heading towards the train. The train is just here. Have a look at your ticket, know your coach number. Only first class proceeding to the left. Coach number 4 right, right beside me, coach number 5 to 10. So baby, we're in coach 3, seat 22 and 23. Annabelle is going there. Don't worry, we didn't forget about you. So the first class is 3,000 Kenya shillings per person and the economy class is I think 500 baht thing. How much is it? It can't be. I don't think. Or 800. Like these seats are pretty big and comfy so she can easily so Annabelle can easily fit yeah. fit in between us so yeah it's interesting that um, the first class is fully booked and the economy isn't I would expect the otherwise. Beef, I think it's beef pilau. We've got chicken with potatoes and some sukuma wiki. We've got chicken with potatoes and some sukuma wiki. And we've got beef ugali, baby. Is it? This is Annabelle. Annabelle, do you want to say hello? Hello. Hello. What are you eating? That's daddy. <laughs> you want to be our camera lady? Baby, I'm employing Annabelle officially as a camera lady right now. Oh, mommy is here. <laughs> ah, daddy's here. Okay. 
Yeah, this is how the train looks like in Kenya. Uh, it's very nice, uh, very decent, clean, and yeah, it was on time, so that is good. And this is my beautiful family. This is how traveling with the kids are. Look at that. What are you doing up there? Guaheri Kenya! We'll see you when we come back. <laughs> okay. You can have a look again. So that is the plane, we're sitting right in the back. We are approaching Istanbul, everyone seems to be happy. This one is happy, this one is happy, <laughs> and this one is the most happiest. <laughs> this one is extremely happy. Ooh. Watch Matrix. Oh, really? Yeah. Matrix 4. All the fun. <laughs> Aeroplanes, Mama! Aeroplanes! Aeroplanes! So, guys, we missed the plane. We missed the connection plane, connection flight. Uh, Turkish Airway, desk line, desk hall. Um, and yeah, they changed it, there was no problem, but the issue is that we'll have to wait uh, now like 11.50, 1.50, 2.50, 3.50, uh, like six hours in the airport. We need to eat something, so let's do it. Um, What pizzas do they have? Uh, so they got quite a few pizzas uh, to choose from. Uh, could I go for the Dilimli pizza menu, please? Uh, and I think, uh, can we go, uh, can you have a one slice salami and let's say one, one mushroom? Thank you. Hello. Hi, how are you? Can I pay for that? Yes, yes. All right, thank you. Can I pay by card? Uh, yes, sir. This is the view from the food court here. Um, so we have to give it to them. The view is like really, really nice. Pizza's here. Can do is just eat, 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 eat. Yes, we have six hours to do that. <laughs> I think this airport is pretty like very modern. So this airport is very modern, baby, right? The only thing which I do, well, a couple of things I don't like about this airport. I don't, the, I don't like the fact that it's too big. So for example, because it's so huge, for that reason. 
we missed the connection flight today. Guys, let me just tell you how we missed the flight. Mm. We came out from the aircraft and uh, in fact we were remaining with one hour to our next flight. Yeah, so we had one hour for the transfer. Yeah. Then mm. when we went to the international transfer, it was like crazy. So it took us like, I don't know, it, like it took us about 25 minutes to get to... 25 minutes to get to the uh, transport. Right? Yeah. And when we arrived there, it was full, 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 full. It was like the queue was very long. There was a massive, massive queue. So we asked the guy, okay, because because uh, Joy was carrying the baby. So Joy was carrying Amalia, I was carrying a rucksack, Annabelle. Joy had a suitcase, so we we all carried like a kit, and we had so many things. Now we asked the guy, is there like a priority line because yeah, for the kids. because a we have kids and b we don't have much time. The guy said yes, there's a priority line for 65 and for 65 years and over, as well as the babies. And he, he said it's only 100 meters here, so we walked there. There's nothing. So we walked back, really exhausted and frustrated, back to the line, to the international transfers. Yeah. Uh, so we just basically came back and we queued, we queued uh, in that line, and by then we already knew that we're not yeah. going to catch our connection our, flight. Our connection. Yeah. So yeah, we ended up missing the connection flight. We went to Turkish airline desk, and luckily they were, yeah, very helpful. Within ten minutes, we had a new ticket very same day and here we are we are waiting it's just that we have to hours. wait yeah for six hours do you know we could have been in prague now we would have been in prague in now, the yeah. house now just relaxing and the most annoying thing is that also the driver was coming to pick us up from the vienna airport so now i had to call him now he has to wait six hours yeah that was so and like i felt sorry for him yeah all right guys yeah so just to Summarize this if you're in Istanbul airport, just make sure you've got at least an hour for your transit time. An hour, two hours. Yeah, because yeah, it is it is busy airport, so just be careful. We still don't know our gate number, still not there, so we're just having a little walk around. <laughs> and we're just actually talking about really interesting story. So guys, finally we have our gate and we are right now, right now we are heading there. Yes, D9 it is. Yeah, so Baby, cool. take us there. Finally on the plane, heading to Prague. So I think two hours, baby? Yeah, two hours. And we are in Europe. We are in Europe, we're in Vienna. Our driver will be there and then heading home. So very, very tired, but very, very happy. Annabelle is calling grandma in Prague. She can't wait to see her. That's what I think.